My husband's cutting the lawn outside before it rains. After he finish cus finishes cutting the run the lawn, we are going for a walk. Okay. We're going for a walk. So I'm finishing my coffee and having my peanuts and then we're off. Um, anyway, um, there's a, a comedian that I really like. I've uh, introduced his, his work before and he recently did a, he does a segment on his program, which is only half an hour long every Monday night. Or is it Tuesday night? I can't remember. Anyway, it's called uh, Rick's Rants. Rick's Rant. Where he walks down a uh, back alley. Strewn with really cool graffiti. And uh, talks about something that he has an opinion on. And he usually has interesting opinions. He's from Newfoundland, you know. People from Newfoundland have really interesting opinions and should be listened to. So, on that note, here is Rick's most current rant. And, you know, I kind of agree with him. I admit, I don't spend that much time thinking about border security. Most Canadians don't, which I guess is something we should be thankful for. But then again, Canadians and Americans, we've always had different views about this sort of thing. Like, Canadians, we're taught in grade six that Canada and the United States share the longest undefended border, and we think that's cool. Whereas most Americans, they don't learn about the undefended border until after they're elected to Congress, and then they panic, which brings us to the brand new Canada-USA border security agreement, which we need for obvious reasons. The problem is the Americans, they say it's a done deal, whereas our government will neither confirm nor deny. Now, luckily, the Americans, they have this crazy idea that people who are affected by this kind of thing have to be consulted. So while our side is saying nothing, we know that the U.S. Border Protection Agency has asked every border state across the continent how they feel about a giant fence being built along the 49th parallel. Sheesh, was it something we said? But then again, if the guy next door wants to build a fence, there's really not much he can do about it other than to say, hey, we don't want the ugly side facing us, okay? No bolts and uprights and stuff, and uh, you got to paint both sides, and uh, how about you lay off the pressure-treated lattice work, why don't you? It's a very slippery slope. Next thing you know, we're standing there in our house coat yelling, hey, any tennis balls come over here? We keep. Hopefully it won't get to that. And hopefully, before our government signs any agreements about our privacy, our security, or the border, we get a peek at the fine print.